What's going on guys, welcome to a new video. So another week, two more brilliant products to show you, two products that are working right now. If this is your first time tuning into the channel, the way these videos work, the way I structure them is I'll show you the creative and the product itself, of course. I'll show you the evidence and the data behind the product just to prove to you that these products are indeed working right now. So if you are watching this video, still looking for that one kind of like golden nugget of a product to launch your business and get it off the ground, then stay tuned because I've got two brilliant products to show you. I'll also go one step further than that because obviously your product and your ad creative are only two pieces to the puzzle. Along with those other pieces, you need a Shopify store to sell the product on. So I'll also show you the competitors, the people selling this product. And then last but not least, I will show you where you can source the products from or I'll show you what you were, what the ballpark numbers are for buying the product. So you have kind of like a rough idea of what sort of profit margins to expect. Before we go any further, I just wanna let you know that I do have a mentorship program we currently have one space open as i'm recording this video so if you like the content i put out on my youtube channel and you like the idea of working one-to-one -one with me and perhaps we could even take one of these products i'm about to show you and help you build a brand around it and launch it and get you to that kind of like 10k per month milestone make sure you stay tuned to the end of the video and i'll show you how to apply for that that being said thanks for tuning in guys hope you enjoy this one Let's get straight into product number one. Okay, so product number one, I'll just play it in the background while I kind of talk you through um, some information about the product. So what's really interesting about this is it's not like a typical camping light that you've seen done time and time again. It actually has, I believe it's 10 meters of LED fairy lights built into it. And as you can see, it's quite, it's like built onto a wire as well. So not only does it look good, but there's actually some kind of like um, real life case use, use case scenario. Um, it's a handy tool to have as well as it actually looks good, looks pretty. Um, there's lots of different applications for it. You have like the festival market, you have the camping market, of course. Um, perhaps if you wanted to take it fishing, there's lots of different applications for the product, lots of different markets. Massive, massive potential and opportunity for this product. The Ad Creative, if you've not already noticed, is a reel rather than, so most people, myself included, when it comes to testing things on Facebook, just instantly go for a square aspect ratio. Um, but this one's selling really well on the reel. So that's something to think about and potentially split test in your own businesses. Enough said then, so how do I know actually this product is selling and it's a winning product and it's working right now? So we can have a look at the engagements, nearly 10,000 thumbs up, three and a half thousand comments and nearly 700 shares. So that's obviously really good. People are obviously enjoying um, the post, enjoying the product. Let's jump into the comment section though. So I just draw your attention to this right hand side here. And there's a couple of things we're looking at. So number one, we're looking at we're looking for intent from people. So people who are asking how to buy it, people who are saying that they want one. Um, or we could even go one step further than that. An even stronger sign of a winning product is if you see pro um, comments like this. So Sue Thomas, excellent, very clever design. Um, James Clifford, just got mine, I love it. So there's somebody who's bought the product. Andrew Smith, I just got mine, awesome. Another person that's bought the product. What we're also looking for as well is feedback about the product. We wanna start a business that can make us some good money and make us some good money in the long run. Something to kind of build upon and provide a platform for launching our business. So we wanna make sure that the product is high quality so that when people receive it, they're satisfied with it. And of course, we don't get any chargebacks or disgruntled customers. So the fact that people are showing that they've bought this and they're actually really happy with the product, that's a win-win, it's perfect. This would be amazing for festivals. Got two sets, very good, good quality, very good, that's awesome. I want one of these in my life. Great lights, just ordered three more. So that could even indicate that Suzanne here has bought four of these things. There are some kind of recent timestamps here as well from a couple of weeks ago, um, some from a bit further beyond, like five weeks and seven weeks. So let's just check out the newest and make sure this is still going on right now. So first of all, if the top comment you see, if it starts with an M, if it's within minutes, then you know for a fact that this is still going really, really well right this second. The first thing that I've noticed here, though, still no response from you despite emails. Please contact me to refund me. So these guys, it sounds like they're a victim of their own success and they're not potentially keeping up um, with the level of orders that they're getting. Or perhaps Eugene has ordered it from a different company and getting these guys confused, who knows. But 20 minutes, 20 minutes, one hour, one hour, one hour, two hours. We can keep opening these up, but I think you guys get the gist. There's lots and lots of comments from recent, which would prove that this is actually working right now. Um, and people are buying this product right now, making it a great contender um, to start your business around and get testing. Okay, so we've seen the products, we've seen what it takes to sell it, the real, the creative. We've seen that people are happy with it. Let's jump onto the Shopify store then. Um, first thing I noticed personally is that it's a .co.uk website. Like 90% of the people or businesses I come across are .com. Dropshipping is such a kind of like USA 
heavy based topic. Most people instantly think, go to the US, that's where I wanna sell my products, but there's plenty of other countries out there, there's billions of other people out there that will be interested in your product that don't live in the USA. So 20 pounds was the second thing I noticed, a very, very cheap product, super tight margins on this. So they either have a super good back end where they're kind of squeezing a bit more out of their customers somehow, or so free shipping from 30 pounds is also a shipping cost on top of this, or potentially the average customer is actually buying two or three of these things. So super basic website, if I may say so, um, nothing too like crazy or too difficult to kind of like replicate or create for yourself. These guys are definitely leaving themselves vulnerable to copycats, but obviously I don't condone copying any of these businesses that purely for example purposes to take inspiration from. If you wanna be successful in a dropshipping space, then you should be aiming to do things better than the next person. The better you do it and the more difficult it is for somebody to come in and essentially compete with you on an equal level i.e. have a similar store design similar products that sort of thing then the easier it is for the kind of market to get flooded that you're competing in and your business to drop off whereas if you do have a super slick website you have a private labeled product obviously makes it more difficult for that to happen so one piece for 20 pounds you can buy one piece on aliexpress delivered for free for about 11 pounds 27 to be honest with you guys this was one of the first supplies i found it's probably for example purposes i'm sure if you did a bit of research contacted a couple of different agents you probably could get one of these things for in and around eight to nine pounds so that's product number one hopefully you guys enjoyed that if you did make sure you hit that like button on the video any questions on anything at all by the way um, make sure you leave a comment down below i do read every single one so i will see and get back to you Moving on to the second product in the pet niche in a dog niche. This is a massive, massive product. Just look at the engagement. It's 90,000 likes, 4,000 comments, and over 7,000 shares. It's one of those products that is in one of the biggest niches of all time, which is, of course, the pet niche. And it's also an emotional type product as well. So it's definitely aimed towards those people who have a really strong connection with their pets. Perhaps they've lost a pet recently, or they live on their own with the pet, whatever it may be it plays on those emotional heartstrings. They might be thinking, seeing the snow in the background, this is a Christmas product, um, it's outdated, it's not working. It is, let's take a look at the comment section. Ours arrived yesterday, five days ago. These aren't even the newest comments either. I got one as a gift and I just love it, four days ago. Absolutely love mine, three weeks ago. Just received mine, eight weeks ago. I love this, I ordered one this week and I can't wait to receive it. So lots, in fact, that was 11 weeks ago, excuse me. Let's go into the newest comments then and drill down into these. So two minutes ago, that that recent, just ordered mine, looking forward to seeing Ted. Uh, can I have the dog color change to black? I bought one, absolutely love it. Can't find this on the site to order. It's never your last goodbye. So like I mentioned, there's gonna be some people on here who've lost a pet um, and want to commemorate and remember them in this lovely way. When it comes to sourcing this product, so we jump onto the store first. No, we won't. Yes, we will. And you might have seen these guys before, Perfect House. They sell lots and lots of products like this. Absolutely brilliant, brilliant business. Super slick website, as you can see. Everything is custom, everything is original. Just a brilliant, brilliant business. I don't like to spend too much time on the Shopify stores because you guys can go and look at the things in your own time. But the key takeaway from this is that if you are gonna be selling these customized and custom products, then you have to have a super slick website that makes it as straightforward and easy as possible to order the product. Any confusion whatsoever, and it's gonna leave the customer puzzled and probably think, oh, I can't be bothered, it's not worth the hassle. So gotta have it super slick, step-by-step. Step. So choose your style, enter the man name, enter the pet name, add to cart, simple as that. Let's jump on to sourcing of the products. So this one is a difficult, and I'm gonna leave this one with you guys to do your own kind of due diligence, due diligence when it comes to finding a supplier for this. Um, Obviously, it's not the sort of stereotypical thing you could get drop sheets from China. You could actually, I couldn't find anyone on AliExpress. So my go-to for this would be contacting some businesses on Etsy in your local country and asking them if they could even put together a different design for you, but encompasses that same kind of um, idea. So the idea, of course, is showing love to a pet with the names on. Like this one here, it's the same product, but a different design. Contacting some businesses and see if they could do something similar for you. Or perhaps instead of a dog, you could even go for a cat. There's lots and lots of options. The idea of this video is to get the kind of creative juices flowing in your mind and spark some ideas of your own. So they're selling the products for about 25 pounds once we do the conversion. You can get one on Etsy for like 16 pounds, that's including free delivery too. So there is room in there. And of course this will be retail price if you contact the manufacturer, potentially you could get it even cheaper than that. 
And so with that being said, then guys, that is it for today's video. Um, as promised, stay tuned and I'll show you how to make an application for that mentorship program. Okay, so it's a very simple and straightforward process. If you like the idea of working one-to-one -one with somebody on a monthly basis, somebody with experience like myself, I've been doing dropshipping now for seven years, then this is what you need to do. So first of all, I want you to know that the reason I put the message at the end of the videos is because I don't want every single person, every man and his dog booking in a call with me because it's gonna waste my time. I only wanna to speak to those people who are actually serious about making a dropshipping business that can actually change their life for the better and they're ready to go all in and commit to it. To do this, what you need to do is head into the description of this video and at the bottom you'll see this so this is a secret link it's going to take you to a type form it's like half a dozen questions it takes two or three minutes to fill out basically it's allows me to get to know you a little bit before we speak on the call so we can see if we're going to be a good fit for working for each other so a couple of things that i want to know basically is what your current experience level is what you want my help doing and ultimately what your goal is to get out of the mentorship if i feel like it's something i can help you achieve then you can schedule a date and time we can jump on a call and have a chat in a bit more depth so if that sounds good to you head over there now fill in that application form takes two or three minutes and i look forward to meeting you on the call cheers Yes.